Hi, it's Sherry Veronica. Now, this Tonika Jamaya, the daughter, 23 years old, she was in a business with some guy, and when they broke up, which is an eventuality, when they broke up, she went back to the business and she took the cops with her. She actually called the cops to, you know, to be there with her because she went back to get her part of the business, the chicken business. So when she got there, the boyfriend, ex-boyfriend told her, well, I sold chickens. The ones that you're seeing here, they are, they are on order. So I don't have anything for you. You can get the step in. There's nothing here for you. So Tonika went off on a rampage. She started breaking things. So the two cops that were with her, a male and a female, I almost think that they should not get no $2,000 each. Why were they compensated $2,000 each? They, they should get out of the way. They should have gone out of the way. When a person's going to tell you that the business that you were a part of and now there's nothing there for you, they should have expected a response from Tonika, okay? You, you're supposed to give people that, that opportunity to respond when someone has spat on them, like, thrown like s-h-i-t in their faces or whatever you're supposed to expect a response but in the meanwhile tonika is going batshit crazy and she is accused of striking the female officer okay accused of so tonika said well i didn't really hit her she got in my way she got in my way i was having a reaction to this this person telling me that there's nothing there for me after we were in business together and this particular officer she got in my way and then the other officer a male seems as though he cat spraddled tonika and tonika responded to him and like <laughs> you know he cat spraddled her and she responded so they both got in her way when she was having a reaction to nothing from a business nothing from a business okay so i really don't think these officers should get a dime but ian we think they should get thinks they should get two thousand dollars each each and she's not working and they're telling her well find some sort of job and get this money and pay these two officers and in the meanwhile the ex-boyfriend gone clear but you're not hearing anything about him you're not hearing anything about him he gone clear Okay, so yeah, Tonika Dottie, you were, in my opinion, you were very, very much in your right to have a reaction. You, you, you had a reaction and the two officers should have backed away, should have backed off and said, okay, he just threw some shit on her and she's having a reaction. Okay, we're going to back off and make sure it doesn't escalate past a certain point, but let her do her thing, back away back away back off okay let her get her steam off and then you know maybe it'll be a situation where she can take the boyfriend to you know civil court or whatever or maybe after she's done what she wanted to do she wouldn't need to take him anywhere because she feels satisfied and thank them thank you for coming here and, and assisting me with this and you go on your merry way and now she has to find a job now they're telling her that she has to find a job and pay these two officers two thousand dollars each via order by Ian Weeks. okay? So that's my opinion. My opinion is she shouldn't have paid them a dime. They should not, they should be trained to walk away and let people, let people like get off some steam when something like this happens. You have to, you have to allow people to react. You just do, you just do, okay? You have to allow people to react, okay? So that's it for this. They're saying that she assaulted the two officers and she has to pay them $2,000 each by a certain time. And she's on bail, $2,500 bail, okay? This is Sherry Veronica.